Okay, so Rashmita has asked a very good question that suppose a patient is having deep vein thrombosis and now the patient develops pulmonary embolism due to that thrombus. So should we give the uh, this patient a head down position, which is also known as Trendenberg's position? Sorry, I'm not very comfortable in that pronunciation. But you understand if this is the head of the patient, this is the leg of the patient, so head down position. So whether we should give it. So historically it was given. Why? For the only reason that pulmonary thrombus, what happens? It obstructs, it, it goes from the RV and obstructs the pulmonary artery. So it obstructs the forward flow uh, uh, of the circulation, it hampers. So this position, head down position and the leg up position, it increases the venous returns towards the heart and increases the preload. And because of that, it helps to maintain the hemodynamics of the patient. But it is not recommended nowadays. It should not be used Why? for the same, for the only reason that the patient is already in a respiratory compromise. The patient is al already struggling for the breath and this patient makes the patient more prone to the respiratory arrest in the patient. So uh, this position, uh, which is also known as Stradenberg position, is not recommended in case of pulmonary embolism secondary to a thrombus. But if you are suspecting that this patient is having air embolism for any reason, suppose uh, while inserting a central line, the patient sucks uh, the air or while removing the central line, uh, if it is not removed in a lying down position, in a sitting position and the patient sucks uh, or for any reason, if the, you are suspecting there is an air embolism in the patient, then we should what we should do is we should tilt the patient towards the left lateral decubitus, left lateral decubitus, left lateral decubitus and head down and uh, leg up, which is again known as Stradenberg position. So this is known as Durant's maneuver, D-U-R-A-N-T maneuver. So if you are suspecting this patient is having air embolism due to any reason, we should do left lateral decubitus and head down position. What this will do is it will keep the air embolus to remain at the RV apex, which is a little far away from the pulmonary artery entrance. So it will prevent the air embolus to go into the pulmonary uh, circulation. So whenever air embolism is suspected, left retal, uh, left decubitus position and head down position. So this is what you should remember. It is very, very important. I hope this clarifies. Do read more about it.